Good guys, you're my dad, Tao here. Today, we are looking into 8200 Pro family. See the two neon lights back there? It would be so nice to do some sort of cyberpunk, sort of straight look photography rather than high fashion. So I purposely adding two LC500 just because it's easier to change the color to matching with the background as a highlight, right? We have the red outfit matching with the red neon lights with the red hair lights. And to fill in her face details, I decide to add in some fuel flash so that her skin looks glowing, but not overpowering the red lights. To have the subjects connected with the background, I add a LC500 to deliver some magenta lights on her hair so that the subjects actually have color corresponding with the background. It's not necessary, it's just personally, I feel it's something nice to have. And you can play around with it. You can change the S200 as a fill lights. You can use the R200 as the key lights, absolutely. There's no correct formula and it's your choice. I use the color gel pack from the R200, right? I use the full CTO to convert the ambient from relevantly gold sort of color into 3200K, which is relevantly blue colors. So it's so much fun to play with. And with multiple lights, you can have a combination of whatever you like. <laughs> 